Firefighters rescue a little girl who was trapped in a burning home. The fire in Paulding County started very early in the morning on Sunday. Fox 5's Denise Dillon tells us there were several people in the home at the time. Investigators told me there were six people inside this town home, four of them children, ranging in age from six months to 19 years old. It was very scary for the family and they were crawling out the windows and um, just trying to get to safety. Neighbors say they heard screams coming from this home on Crescentwood Drive in Hiram just before 1 a.m. Sunday. The second floor of the home was on fire. And there was a, a lady standing on the ledge of the overhang and smoke coming out. A young man escaped the fire by going through this window. Somebody jumped out of the back bedroom window onto the porch and broke a leg. When firefighters pulled up, the five family members who got out said there was still a 10-year-old girl inside. She was trapped on the second floor. Firefighters ran into the building, threw the smoke and flames to find her. A fireman ran out hold, um, holding the little girl and she, uh, they put her in the ambulance and took her off. Fire officials say she was unconscious but still breathing. She was airlifted to Children's Health Care of Atlanta at Eggleston and then transferred to JMS Burn Center in Augusta. Neighbors are saying an extra prayer for her. We're all just praying and hoping that if there's anything we can do, they will reach out to us as a community. And praising the firefighters. Thank God for those heroic firemen. Fire officials say the 10-year-old girl is improving. As for how this fire started, the state fire marshal's office is trying to figure that out. In Paulding County, Denise Stillen, Fox 5 News.